cage and it just felt so much softer in my hands and so much more low profile. In fact, the camera felt like it got smaller. And lastly, this is one of the bigger reasons why we're getting rid of this cage. Um, it's really all of this adding up over the last few years. But this level, first of all, never used it, never looked at it, okay? This makes it so that this side of the camera isn't flat. And what that means is when you're trying to screw this onto something that's bigger than let's say the inch that's here, it'll be lopsided or it'll kind of angle down because of this bevel or because this protrudes so much. More recently, we were trying to put this on a teleprompter vertically and we couldn't because this made it so that this side wasn't flat. Now we could do this side, but we needed the HDMI out and the audio out. So it presented us with a very, very annoying problem the day of the shoot. Version two has the same uh, protruding level. And that was kind of the last straw, you could say, for why we're getting rid of this cage.